So for blood glucose station, all identity checks and safety checks has been performed. So I will now start with assembling the equipment. So before that, I have to do my hand hygiene using a hand gel, following the WHO steps for hand hygiene. Palm to palm, back of the hands, fingers interlace, fingers interlock, rotational cleaning of thumb, fingertips, and let it air dry for 30 seconds. So I have to make sure that I have my blood glucose machine, which has been clean and calibrated in the last 24 hours. I have here my tray, which is disposable and visibly clean, and I'm happy to use it. I have here my single-use lancet, dry and intact. I have here my glucose testing strip in an airtight container and expires 2028-131. So a few strips inside. I have here my sterile gauze in a dry intact packaging, expires 2027-311. I have here a quinell wipe, dry and intact packaging, expires 2028-1215 if I need to clean my um, the finger of my patient. And I'll make sure I have my sharps box, which is not three-fourths full. So I, all, um, I have my equipment for the blood glucose station. I'm happy to proceed to my patient. So before proceeding, to do my hand hygiene again. So hello Jennifer, um, good afternoon. So I have prepared the um, equipment for the blood glucose. So again, um, as you've requested, you wanted a random um, post meal blood glucose just before you go home this afternoon. So it says here that you're a type 2 diabetes. Is that correct? That's correct. Okay, so I'll be performing that um, I have just have to wear my PPE on. Am I getting your consent for this one? Yes, you have them. Okay, thank you. So I'll just have to do my hand hygiene again. So Jennifer, just to ask, um, what, um, which side did you had it earlier on? Um, the the blood glucose check. I think I had it on my left finger. In your left um finger. So we could use your, um, which finger would you, um, would you still remember where it was? Last, um, I think it was my ring finger. Your ring finger. So we could just, um, if you want, you could just put it, um, check it, uh, the side of the middle, uh, of the middle finger. Okay. That's okay. Because it's important that we rotate the sides to prevent any, um, tissue damage or injury and also not to use the thumb and the, um, for a finger, okay? Okay. So, can I just visually inspect as well your um, hands? It says here that you've um, just washed your hands. So just, can I just check if it's visibly clean so yeah. I don't need to clean them? So right, I can see it's visibly clean so I'm happy to check that, okay? So I'll just have to get this lancet. So I have here a single use lancet. Just gonna open it. So I'm just gonna get a sample from the side of your uh, middle finger. Is that okay? That's okay. Okay. So one, two, three, sharp scratch. Just pose it. So Jennifer, I'll just get the strip and put it in the glucometer. So I will just get a sample from your from the side of your middle finger making sure I cover the window of the testing strip okay okay thank you so while waiting for that I will just get a gauze and just apply a gentle pressure so Jennifer I could see here that the result is 6.3 millimole per liter so because you're a type 2 uh, you've got the type 2 
diabetes for a post meal, the regular or the normal range should be less than 8.5 millimole per liter. And if it's a pre meal, it should be between 4 to 7 millimole per liter. Okay? Okay. So it's within the normal range. So um, we'll just make sure that you check this uh, when you're at home as well. Okay? So I'll just dispose this as well in the sharps box. Um, I'll just double check as well if this is still bleeding. So no more bleeding. And I'll dispose this in the clinical waste bin. I'll make sure that I have cleaned this with um, Clinel wipes as well, ready for the next use and dispose my tray. So Jennifer, I'll just document everything in your chart. Um, if you've got any questions, um, you have the buzzer there. So feel free to ring that and I'm happy to assist you with anything. Okay. okay. So again, thank you for your time. And I'll make sure to carefully document your result. So this is day to day, the 31st of the 10th, 2023, and it's 1400. And your result is 6.3 millimole per liter. And your name is Jane Doe. Great. So I have carefully and legibly documented the result, Jennifer. Okay. So I'm just gonna thank you for your time again. So I'm just gonna close my, I'm just gonna do my hand hygiene before I leave. Let it air dry for 30 seconds. 